Hello, Steam Rays. Hello, everybody. It's the February Wooden Awards. Thank you for joining us again. We're so excited to acknowledge our students that received the Fitness and the Skill Wooden Award for the month of February. And I always come with quotes. So here's our fitness quote for this month. For fitness, do your best 100% and succeed, you must eat right, think right, and act right. True happiness comes from the things that cannot be taken away from you. Making the full effort to do the right thing can never be taken away from you. If you see others breaking the rules, tell yourself. They are hurting themselves, but they are teaching me what not to do. So there we are for fitness. Let's do skill. Skill, we see, is practice makes perfect. Be good at what you do. Learn the subject. Master the task, whether it's geography or gymnastics. You have to know what you're doing and you have to be able to do it quickly and properly. To improve your level of skill, it takes practice, study, and repetition, repetition, repetition. Congratulations, boys and girls. Thank you, teachers, for recognizing these amazing traits in our scholars. We'll see you in oh, March. Bye. Hello everybody, I take great honor in presenting my next two wooden awards. This one is going to Jacob Meza for fitness. Jacob is always eager to participate and when I ask him to, he gets up and he stretches and he does our counting. I'm so proud of Jacob. My second award winner goes to Alana Cow for skill. Every time I look at her, she's ready to do the work. She's focused. She's doing 100%. She brings her A game every single day to school. Mwah! I'm so proud of all of my scholars. Congratulations. Hi friends, this is Ms. Bonnet announcing Wooden Awards for Columbia. For fitness, Jedediah. He is always dancing to our wiggle breaks and showing his high energy spirit. And for skill, Aaliyah. She is always completing all of her reading centers and is constantly working on building her skills in math and reading. Great job, Columbia. Hi, scholars. It's Miss Valdivia, and I'm here to announce the Wooden Award winners. For fitness, we have Iker Robles Ochoa, and he's been doing such an awesome job showing us his sweet soccer moves, and he loves to write stories about soccer. So awesome job, Iker. Keep it up. And next up, we have um, our award for skill, and that goes to Angel Guadarrama. Angel does such a great job keeping up with his sight words every week. He works so hard on all his classwork, and he even studies after class working hard on our programs. So keep it up, Angel. You're doing awesome. Thank you so much, guys. Congratulations. Hi friends, it's Mrs. Elliot from Oregon, and I have two award winners for our Wooden Awards in February. My first winner is getting an award for fitness, and that is Derek Rios Trujillo, and he is just a superstar when it comes to fitness. He is our dancer. He loves to get up and move, and he always reminds us to do the same. Way to go, Derek. And my second winner is Miss Madison Esquivel for her study skills. Her desk is always super clean. She always has her supplies in front of her and she does a great job staying focused and making sure she always knows what she's supposed to do. Awesome job, Madison. So proud of both of my winners. Hi scholars, it's Mrs. Dow from Boston College and I'm announcing the Wooden Award winners for February. The first is Pedro Torres. For fitness, he is always telling us how much he loves soccer and he wants to be a soccer player when he grows up. And the next is for Isabella Ariano for skill. She has great study skills and organizational habits. She's always ready to go with her materials and ready for the day. Congratulations, scholars. Hi, scholars. Miss Gloucester here from Duke University, and I am here to announce our winning award winners for February. For exercise, we have Leandro. I chose Leandro because he is always talking about the different sports he plays to exercise and loves to do Go Noodle whenever he can. Evan was chosen for skill because he works hard to achieve anything that he puts his mind to. Great job, Evan and Leandro. Keep up the great work, scholars. Hello from Stanford. I'm Miss Roberts here. First up, I have Emily Valdez. 
for fitness. Emily always gets up right away every time we do a go noodle and she always participates in them. She also is a healthy eater and tries to eat less candy. Next up, I have Jennifer Silvis for skill. Jenny is a super capable student. She's always on top of her work and I appreciate her every day that she comes to class. Hi scholars, it's time to make some noise for the Clemson Tigers, woo woo! We are celebrating two incredible scholars today, my friend Ian Grijalva for fitness. Way to go Ian, always taking care of your mind and body, I love it. You know that mental health is just as important as physical health and I love that you take care of yourself in that way. My next friend is my friend Juliet Wright for skill. Juliet shows her skill in everything she does. She is so precise, meticulous, and she keeps on trying until she gets it right. She is so wonderful in every aspect. So shout out to both of my incredible tigers and to all of our tigers. I'm very excited to share the winning award winners from Wisconsin for the month of February. For fitness, we have Emma Silvis. Emma finds lots of ways to stay active while at home. For skill, we have Angel Diaz Delgado. Angel always tries his best to perfect his skills, especially in math. Great job, Emma and Angel. Hey scholars, today I'm here to congratulate two Wolverines for the Skill and Fitness Wooden Award. The Skill Award goes to Jet. Jet has great study habits, as well as he's always practicing the new skills he learns in class. And the Fitness Award goes to Dylan. Dylan always tries to find ways to stay fit, as well as he prides himself on being a talented soccer player. Awesome job, scholars. Hey friends, it's Mr. Herschler for the February Wooden Awards. For fitness, I selected Michael Rosado. Congratulations for always being so fit on your skateboard and dirt bike. And for skill, I chose Kevin Mazariegos for excellent piano playing. Thank you, too. Hey, Stingrays. Help me congratulate our Longhorns for the Fitness and Skill Wooden Awards. For fitness, we have Damien Chamu. And Damien is a top scholar who always does his best. And while he's probably not able to play sports the way he normally did, he always stays active by taking care of his siblings and being a good brother and son. Then for skill, we have Ian Corona. Since the beginning, Ian has mastered many standards, and it brings such a smile to my face when I see him work hard he gets so excited when he gets things correct and loves to share his answers as well. Excellent job, gentlemen. So proud of you. Good morning, everyone. This is Miss Aguilar. I hope you're all having a wonderful day. It is February, and that means there are new Wooden Award winners. Our first winner for Ohio State is going to be Jamie Roman, and she is earning the Wooden Award for fitness. She stays active at home um, by using her trampoline, and she has so much energy that during our fifth grade workout, she was keeping up with the instructor, and she was doing this all with a smile and positive attitude. Our next winner is going to be Donovan Munoz and he is going to be receiving the award for skill. He has been practicing on practicing rereading questions and finding the best place for him to study at home. These skills have definitely helped him and are going to make him more successful. Congratulations to both of these winners and all of the other winners for the Wooden Awards. Hi Stingrays, this is Miss Baruch with Villanova's February Wooden Award winners. First, I'd like to congratulate Juju Parker for fitness he um, not only shows fitness through his actions and his dedication to football, but also through the way that he thinks. With a positive, um, positive attitude and a growth mindset all the time, he's always willing to do the right thing. I'd also like to congratulate Arlette Lopez for skill, not only in academics, but in the arts. She's always willing to practice, to improve, taking notes, asking questions, and um, it pays off and shows in her skill. So thank you, Arlette. Thank you, Juju. Congratulations to you both and congratulations to all the other Wooden Award winners. Hi, scholars. This is Mrs. Thomas from Tuskegee University. Please help me in congratulating this month's Wooden Award winners from our classroom. For fitness, we have Hugo Rojas, who is part of a travel baseball team. He participates in practices each week and has tournaments on the weekends. 
For skill, we have Rodrigo Leon, who does a fantastic job of making sure he practices what we learn in class each and every day, which can be evidenced in all of his tests and quizzes. Congratulations. Hi, Stingrays. It's Miss Ye here from UCLA, and I'm really excited to announce our Wooden Award winners for January and February. Our first winner is Axel Martinez for fitness. Axel is such a fit kid. He is not only great on the basketball court and the soccer field, but he is a super avid bike rider. He goes on mega mile bike rides multiple times a week with his family. He is just an overall really fit scholar. Congratulations, Axel. Our next Wooden Award winner goes to Marcus Fisher Jr. for skill. If you don't know Marcus, then uh, you should know that this kid knows so much about everything. He is always looking for new ways to solve math problems. He is an outstanding writer. He knows a ton about science. Social studies is really his favorite. And what you may not know is that Marcus is an exceptional history buff, especially World War II history. And brace yourself, he knows pretty much everything about Russian culture and Russian history. This kid is just an overall encyclopedia of knowledge. So congratulations, Marcus, and congratulations to all of you Stingrays. All right, hello Stingrays, this is Ms. Pursuto from University of Hawaii, and I'm here to congratulate two warriors. Uh, the first one being Johnny Dominguez for um, fitness. So Johnny is a scholar athlete and I miss watching him play soccer and basketball, but he definitely kills it on the court in the field. So congratulations, Johnny. And for skill, I am going to give that to Claudia Amesqua. She is always studying, putting forth effort and showing off her skills in the classroom. So congratulations, Claudia. And I'm very proud of you uh, both. So. Hi Scholars, this is Miss Wright with the Wooden Award winners for USC for February. For skill, we have Joanna Perez, who's always applying new skills to what she's learned. For fitness, we have Christopher Flores, who is a soccer player and also finds time to take care of his many, many pets. Great job, you guys. This is Baron Ishin here with your Notre Dame winners. The first award for fitness goes to a young lady that always seems like she's practicing her fitness skills outside of class by attending dance lessons. I think you know who you are. Congratulations to Miss Amy Corona. And the next award goes to a young lady that always seems to be practicing her skills. Whether it's math skills or reading skills, she's always attending math jam group or office hours to um, continue her skill building and is always up for a good practice session. That award goes to Miss Anna Valdez. You can even see here, she's practicing her engineering skills, building a gingerbread house. Congratulations, ladies, you make Notre Dame proud. Hi everyone, this is Miss Gonzalez with Princeton eighth graders. So today's, well, this month's wooden awards are for skill and fitness. So I have two lovely young ladies in my class who actually fit into both of these categories. So I wanted to go ahead and talk about these two. So we have Jocelyn Uriate and Rachel Ahamilla. Um, they both are involved in sports. So Rachel is in water polo. She's actually on the junior national team. And um, Miss Jocelyn is in gymnastics and has actually made it to state this year. So um, they are both very much into their fitness and their sports and are very highly skilled in class, always asking questions, always trying their best on their work. Um, and I just truly adore both of these young ladies. And I felt like this is the perfect award and they both deserve both. So congrats to Jocelyn and Rachel. Thanks. 